everybody. Welcome to our YouTube channel. This is our family and we are off grid on Friday. Today I decided to bring in some reinforcements. We absolutely love it when our kids get engaged in these projects alongside us. You might remember in one of our previous videos that our oldest daughter Eliana has started helping us film in certain scenes. And now you can see my son, he wants to get in on the action as well. This T is going to hook up to the toilet supply line here. Three-way T. It's times like these that make for some of the best memories. Stuff mm -hmm. while well, even though you're still in the video. Yeah. But you just pause this. It's like you pause the video. And you yeah. It's you're making the video. Making the video, sir. All right. So that. Sometimes it's you know what this has been a really good drill to me. Like a 
I hope that's how you do it. The instructions have no diagrams, so either they expect everyone knows exactly what they're doing or it's just not that hard. Or they're bad. They're just bad instructions. But either way. Oh, speaking of instructions, I can't believe how hard it is to make a Lego set with all the right pieces and no missing pieces. Dude, you're right about that. It's it's bananas. And they have extra pieces so you don't even know unless you have instructions. It's crazy. To me, it's wild. I'm really hoping everything works, buddy, because there's a lot of, like, there's so many connections, water connections, and water, like, it'll, it'll tell you if you're doing it wrong. It'll call you, it'll, what your grandpa says, it'll call you a liar. Like, it'll show you where you did a bad job because it'll leak. It'll leak good, too. Take the other one here. Remember what I said about plastic is, you thread metal into plastic, you want to be careful, you want to be careful not to cross thread it because you'll ruin it for good. And that's sad because metal's stronger than plastic. Do what happens. Do what, do what happens, buddy. Whenever I find myself at an impasse in a project, Corinne is always there to help me figure my way out of it. Please, please. Okay, that's water. I think that's how you manually do it if you don't have water. But what I'm saying is, water's not coming up. Right, so that that shows that something's wrong, not that you need to fill it. No, it shows okay, the wrong thing. So my pump being over here past the toilet doesn't work. So I'm going to disconnect it and hopefully have a good success. Anyway, it doesn't work so I'm going to put this line and drain it and see if, uh, see if I can't figure this out, hopefully put it before the toilet and everybody wins. But yeah. Let me, uh, let me make sure that that valve is off. I think it's on. It's a lot of work.
Thank you so much for watching this video. I just want to take this quick break to ask if you really enjoy our content. Please like and subscribe. Okay, let's see what happens. There's that. That, not doing what I wanted it to do. That. Okay. Well, that's going up. Let's see if we have pressure over here. Yep. <laughs> 